Hello, Adam Olinger from the channel Adam Does Movies on YouTube. I'm sure most of you have heard of it. A lot of, a lot of heads shaking now. Okay, well, let's just get right down to brass tacks. I'm here to try out for a plethora of roles in the Transformers reboot films. I hear the scripts are staying the same, very true to the uh, Michael Bay vision. We're just going to remake them for, for cash grabbing purposes. Okay. I'm literally going to kill you. Kate Yeager. <laughs> when I find out who's behind this. He's going to die. What a very Optimus Prime thing to say. For any Kyle Yeager scene, I'd like you to pretend that there's an American flag behind me. Actually, multiple American flags would be ideal. I'm just engulfed in American flags, really. I don't think this is a truck at all. I think we just found a Transformer. Oh, fuck. I'm getting tangled up in one of my fictitious American flags. I know it's going to be tough to top Megan Fox's performance in the first two films, but I'm going to try it. If you think you want to, for this rebooted series, want to go with a male sex symbol, maybe Witwicky's gay, er, you could try it. I could be like the male, like, pretty boy. I know, it's, it's not much of a stretch. Pretend I'm like leaning on a bike. Camera pans in slowly. I'm dripping with sweat. I got a tank on. Daisy Dukes. Chest out. Pop the back. Pop the ass. We're retrieving the seed. And then we're fucking done defending the humans. Autobots, roll out. He doesn't swear in the scene. I know that. I also know he doesn't smoke. But I figure Optimus is like really badass. He's brandishing an eye patch. He's just, he's had enough. He's done with the humans. He's been done with the humans since he landed on Earth like five movies back, right? So now he's just really done. He's really done for kids. Camera does a reach around, goes underneath the tush, underneath the ball sack. You get all up in that business. Because this is a Transformers movie. This is for kids. We want to make sure that there's a lot of sexualization on both sides. Shove the cube into my chest, Sam. Sam, give me the fucking cube in my chest. Put the fucking cube in my chest, you piece of shit. <laughs> right now. Cube. Chest. Insert it! Oh, hello, who are you? I'm a cube. Can I go in your chest, Optimus? Yes, that's exactly what I want you to fucking do. You understand, Sam Witwicky? More like Sam Dick Icky. For this next portion, I'll be playing the role of one of the humping robots. I'd also like some assistance with this. So if one of the female interns... No, no, gross, not you. The one over there eating the celery stick for lunch. Help me out for a second. Just gonna get down by your leg. Optimus! Bumblebee! Optimus! Whoa! No, 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 no! Optimus! <laughs> Optimus! Bumblebee! My face is my warrant. I remember that line from one of the films because it was so stupid. I think we should bring back the Mountain Dew robot. I'm gonna take a shot at him now. <laughs> Buy a Mountain Dew. <laughs> Shoots one to himself. That's good Mountain Dew. Pop explodes everywhere. It's like acid. Bumblebee! It's killing me, but it tastes so good at the same time. Buy a Mountain Dew or a Budweiser. Budweiser robot comes out. <laughs> Jaeger catches it. <laughs> Pops the top. Look, 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 look. <laughs> Let's go kick some ass, guys. <laughs> Transformers, robots in disguise. Budweiser, drink a cold one now. <laughs> At this time, I'd like to play the part of Shy being seduced by the hot female Decepticon from Transformers 2. If I could get that same intern back again, unless you have like a brunette version, that'll also work. Very similar in feet. No, not, not you. Please, God, no. Oh, no, don't touch me all over, hot celery girl. <laughs> what are you doing after this? If there is for some reason not a role or multiple roles for me in these films, I could also do the sound effects. There's always stuff moving.
helicopter goes down. That's the propeller blade. Propeller blade always comes off the helicopter, runs around on the ground for a little bit, then flies at the camera three-dimensionally. No, 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 no! Transformer flips over. Throws them out to Ducan. I'm going to do some lines for some of the most well-respected Transformers to date. Skids and Mudflap. I'm told they're like the crows in Dumbo. Very well written. Very appreciated characters from the audience. Let's pop a cap in his ass. Throw him in the trunk and nobody gonna know no nothing. You know what I mean? Tell us how you really feel, cracker! I feel gross just talking like this. Why don't you get a haircut with your bitch ass? Hey, 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 you know the glyphs? These? The glyphs that have been rolling around in my head? That's old school, yo. That's like Cybertronian shit. He didn't put the shit in the end, but I felt they just came to me naturally. They gotta mean something, like a map. Like a map to an Energon source. Can you read this? Read? No, we don't really do much reading. Not so much. I do want to leave you with some ideas I just came up with on the top of my head uh, for future Transformers films, which I assume is the process that Bay and company go through when they write them. Um, let's see, what can we do? How about in Transformers 16, Optimus uh, turns out that he's been Bumblebee the whole time. And Bumblebee uh, was never a Transformer at all. He was a Decepticon. He's, a he's, a, he's been a Decepticon since day one. What, what purpose does that serve? Who cares? What purpose does any of this serve? Giganticon. The only way to defeat him is to defeat their own kind. So all the Transformers and Decepticons have to kill themselves. What? How are they possibly going to get out of this one? Turns out Kyle Yeager has been a Transformer the whole time in disguise. He's the real Optimus Prime. We don't find this out until, uh, let's say, the 30th movie. It's a, long, it's a long road to get there, but it's going to pay off for absolutely nobody. Things really start to jump the shark when Optimus and company start a baseball team. It's kind of a league of their own sort of situation. Shy is coming back as Coach Witwicky to lead the team to victory. It's going to be a smaller scale story, but the budget's going to be about $450 million. Zombie Transformers? Has that been done before? If not, it's happening. We'll call them Zombitrons. And the only way to kill them is by blowing their fucking heads off. It's for kids still. It's a, it's a hard PG rating. Maybe a Sin City-esque Transformers film. Hot females. Robot on robot. A lot of nudity. A lot of swearing. I mean, we're, we're almost there already, you know? It's just a natural progression of things. Thanks again for your time. Well, once again, the channel's Adam Does Movies. I'm sure you all know. She, nobody's shaking their head. If I could get that... Celery intern to come with me. Could maybe talk a little bit more about this over dinner. Thanks for watching the video. Feel free to check me out on social media platforms for credibility purposes. Intern Sheila should be putting up some graphics for you to digest, I believe. Otherwise, you'll be out on the curb like your mom. Gotta move on. You can also check me out on patreon.com slash adamdoesmovies. Throw me a buck or two if you want. I run this channel alone. It's, a, it's almost a full-time job, honestly. Thanks for your time. Sheila, the graphics, now.